What's up guys? I'm Travis with Going With The Flow RV Adventures. Welcome to another episode. Uh, today we are going to do some uh, RV air conditioning maintenance. And uh, if you're looking for an easy uh, cleaning solution to clean your coils on your AC, I got this new stuff uh, I could tell you about, the friend of mine told me about. So check this out. What's up guys, welcome back. So uh, so this is what I'm doing. Uh, this stuff here is, uh, let's see, make sure you can see that. I hope you can read, well, can't read it, whatever. But it's called Airtron Corporation makes this. And uh, it's called Blue Max. It's a high foaming, clinging coil cleaner. It, uh, it helps uh, clean all your coils. It's easy to use and uh, you gotta mix it up. I've got some instructions on the bottle here. Uh, a friend of mine told me about this, uh, Joey from uh, Joey's Refrigeration in New Iberia, Louisiana. So uh, he sent me to a place uh, to get some of this stuff, uh, and uh, I tried it on the first air condition, and uh, I got three of them. So I tried it on the first one, and uh, man, what a big difference. So I'll show you the difference on those when I get back up there. But I thought I'd start off like this. Uh, this stuff you mix with... Um, with water and it's a it's five uh five to one so i got a little spray bottle here uh and it shows you on there five to one four to one whatever the ratio uh you want to mix is and uh so i just mix it five to one's here now he told me my friend told me to do a little more than what it tells you uh so i just put a little a little extra in there and then filled it up with water so let's go up there and check it out Oh, all right. Climbing up the roof. That's uh, not too easy for an old man. All right, so let's check this out here. Uh, I'll show you. I'll show you what I did on the front here. Well, actually, let's start with the middle one. We'll start to finish. Let's see here. All right, so this is the uh, the middle the middle AC. I haven't worked on that one yet, um, but uh, that's what it looks like before. Get a little close up shot. It's pretty dirty. Uh, I haven't cleaned this in quite a while. Never cleaned it with this stuff. Now here is the front AC. And uh, that one there, I cleaned already. That one's clean, pretty clean. So, getting back here. Now I'm gonna do this one, start to finish. And uh, make sure my, my camera's set up right. Now, just as I start this next part, just as I start this next part, they're hitting the chainsaw again back there, cutting some trees down. We're uh, we're in uh, at my mom's house in Louisiana and New Iberia, where we we're originally from. I am, anyways, and uh, we've had a little freeze come through the last couple of days, which is in Louisiana. That's a big deal. Uh, but it was only a couple days and now the weather's nice so people are out guys cutting trees down so you'll hear that periodically all right so this first step really simple uh i'm not even gonna rinse this coil off uh the first time i do this but you just spray this up really good with this mixture i'm just gonna spray it real good all over the coil and uh, man, immediately it starts to work. Now, one thing I'm gonna be cautious of is, uh, is to rinse all this stuff off. Uh, uh, when I rinse the coils is mainly the roof as well. 
um, because this stuff may, uh, and, and also the side of your RV, you know, this stuff is a uh, kind of a, uh, it's a, uh, it's acidity, not really acid, but it has a little, a little kick to it, so to speak. You can't smell anything. It's not that strong. That's why you mix it. But, uh, when, when you do get this off the roof, spray this, uh, with the hose really, really good to get all of it off, off your coil, the AC, and the roof, the roof for sure, and the sides of the RV. But man, that's pretty much it. Now, the inside, the insides of these, this coil is uh, not, not really dirty because, you know, it sucks all the air in this way. So all of that, that dust and stuff gets trapped in there. But uh, I'm gonna let it sit. Give it a little bit more spray there. All right, I'm gonna let that sit there for about five minutes. And uh, uh, catch some rays. All right, so it's been about four or five minutes, so I'm gonna spray this off real good. And uh, you'll see the difference as I spray it. Now, when you're spraying this, be sure not to spray these coils very hard. You don't wanna damage the fins on them. And some of them, uh, you can see uh, a couple of mine or a little bit just right here and they get really bent pretty easy so I didn't do this but uh, it, it's been there there all right so uh, so you're gonna want to spray this off really well but gently both inside and out is what I'm doing uh, and then spray the roof down so check this out really gently and uh, man it comes out Right, right away with E. See the, uh, that's it. Yep. I did the other one, I did the the uh, front one two, two times, twice, so I'm gonna do this one twice, but. All right, so that was uh, the first time. Uh, it got a lot off, quite a bit. I'm gonna do it again uh, now, cause uh, this is the second time. Uh, the stuff is, uh, you could use this pretty liberally. So I got enough to do this side and then I'll fill up the bottle again. But this time uh, I'll let it sit a little while longer. Maybe a whole five minutes instead of four. That didn't take very long uh, I took my time of course doing video and stuff uh, you know in between but uh, really and truly it'd probably take you about I don't know what you gotta let it you know set for five minutes so if you got three AC just 15 minutes do it twice 30 minutes literally less than an hour so now that we're done I think uh, I'm ready for a cold beer what you think, babe? I got it. Sweet. And I'm still drinking coffee. Coffee? <laughs> <laughs> nice. What a beautiful day, ain't it? Yeah. I like that it's starting to warm up. Yep. <laughs> 